It's Check on Stories. We're following for you on Robin Hood Radio in Cornwall at 8.30. The Park and Rec Senior Outing. You'll leave from the United Church of Christ. 9 till 5, the National Iron Bank has their grand reopening. And at 7 p.m. in Cornwall, town meeting, five-year capital plan at the town hall. Makers and Bakers in Kent. Kent Affordable Housing's 14th Annual Benefit and 3rd Makers and Bakers Market will be held October 25th and 26th from 10 till 3 at St. Andrew's Parish House. You can get whole pies. You can sell out quickly, so plan to come early. There will also be products by craftsmen and artisans. Preview party will be on the 25th from 6 till 7.30 at the Parish House. Admission there, $30 per person in advance. For more information, kentaffordablehousing.org. The Housatonic Camera Club has their Fall 2019 Members Photo Exhibition, Housatonic Art and Frame on Route 7 in Cornwall Bridge. The show will remain up through Saturday, October 26th. Medication Take Back Day is on Saturday, the 26th, from 10 till 2. Connecticut's Police Headquarters, Troop B, in Canaan, Connecticut. Unused or expired prescription medications can be a public safety issue and lead to accidental poisoning, misuse, and overdose. To address this public safety concern, local law enforcement and Sharon Hospital teaming up to help community members dispose of unwanted prescriptions, over-the-counter, and pet medications. It's free and anonymous. Medications should be kept in a Original packaging with the patient information removed. Participants will receive a tote bag for participating while supplies last. Teens in grades 8 to 12 invited to the Pine Plains Free Library for a full day of spooky movie creation. It'll be held Saturday the 26th from 10 till 3. Participants will learn what makes movies scary and then write their own script and film their own short horror film. The event will be led by youth author Tom Quackenbush. Participants should bring a bag lunch to register 518-398-1927 or email info at pineplainslibrary.org. The first annual North Canaan Autumn Jubilee Chili Contest being held Saturday from 11 till 2, judged by the public. I stop in, purchase a $5 tasting ticket sponsored by Berkshire Hills Design. The Autumn Jubilee on Saturday, free family fun from 1 till 4 o'clock. In Canaan, across from the Douglas Library, gains, wagon rides, face painting, pumpkin decorating, and more. Costumes are welcome. The chili contest from 11 till 2, cider and cookies from 3 till 5, and a magic show from 4.30 until 5.30. DM Hunt Library presenting group exhibition Spirit Animals featuring 45 artists from the tri-state area. Curated by Lily Woodworth and Garth Coble, the opening reception will be on Saturday from 4 until 6 p.m. The items will remain on display through Saturday, November the 30th. There will be a family-friendly Halloween event with a costume parade, pizza dinner, haunted walkway, and more on Saturday, October 26th from 5 till 8 p.m. at the Kent Community House. Admission $5 per person or $20 for a family of five or more. More information at 860-927-1003. Learn about sustainable farming with a wagon ride and tour by farmer Tom Brazy. Takeout farm dinners will also be available. This is happening every Friday from 5 till 7 with free music and an invitation to sit around the fire pit. Their farm is located at 343 New Marlboro, Southfield Road in the town of New Marlboro. The Housatonic Valley Regional High School Haunted House is Saturday, starting at 7 to 9.30. Entrance tickets can be purchased at the door, $7 for the first time around, $5 for any additional time. Concessions will be sold by the senior class. It's hosted by the senior and junior class councils. Sharon Audubon will host its annual Kids Day on Sunday from 12 to 3 at the Sharon Audubon Center on Route 4 in Sharon. It's geared towards children and their families, carnival-type games, kids' crafts, live animals, hay bale maze, hay wagon shuttles, professional face painting, a large leaf pit for jumping, balloon twisting, and snacks, including fresh, delicious apple cider, donuts from Great Cape Baking Company. Children encouraged to come in costume and join in the costume parade around the center grounds at 2.30, sponsored in part by the Armand Oppenheimer Environmental Fund, Northwest Realty, Sharon Dental Associates, Sharon Hospital, Ideal for children pre-K through third grade. Admission, only $20 per car load at the gate. More information at 860-364-0520 or sharon.audubon.org slash audubons kids hyphen day.
It's your chance to meet the 2019 Democratic Municipal Election candidates at the Town Grove in Lakeville coming up this Sunday from 4 until 7 p.m. All voters are welcome. A free family barbecue. You're invited to bring your entire family. It's put on by the Salisbury Democratic Town Committee. Our business brief is underwritten by Morgans at the Interlake in Interlake and in.com and by Salisbury Bank, salisburybank.com. The Dow Jones Industrial Average was down 28.42 to 26,805.53 yesterday. NASDAQ starts off today at 8185.80 and the S&P 500 at 3,010.29. We'll take a look at the tri-state forecast. That'll come your way in just a few moments.